After centuries of mystery, scholars have turned to science to uncover the truth behind the Codex Gigas, one of the world's most baffling books. And what they found is incredible. Let's start with carbon dating. In the early 2000s, researchers tested the parchment and confirmed it dates to around 1220 AD, placing it right in the heart of medieval Bohemia. That aligns with historical records and proves it's not a forgery or modern hoax. Then comes the parchment itself. Over 160 donkey skins were used to make the pages. That has been confirmed through parchment analysis, showing just how much labor and material this book required. What about the ink? Scientists found it was made using iron gall ink, a typical medieval blend of oak galls and iron salts. And the artwork, especially the full-page image of the devil. Tests show that it was painted with mineral-based pigments, consistent with those used in other 13th century manuscripts. But the breakthroughs don't stop there. Using high-resolution scans and infrared imaging, modern scholars can now explore the codex without even touching it. These scans reveal hidden text, marginalia, corrections, and even layers of ink that can't be seen with the naked eye. Some parts of the manuscript were edited or reworked, meaning even this perfect book went through a process of trial and revision. And there's more. Today, scientists are analyzing the parchment's DNA to trace the origins of the animal skins used. Were they sourced locally in Bohemia or traded from across Europe? Even the devil's image is under fresh investigation. Is it just a warning against sin, a symbol of monastic fear, or something deeper, an artistic expression of medieval theology? One thing is clear. The Codex isn't just a religious artifact. It's a medieval masterpiece of science, art, and devotion built by hand and now decoded by science. 